हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू पांडे गुरुजी यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट द इन्फोसिस एस इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन सो बेसिकली एस इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन बेसिकली आस्क फॉर द प्रोफाइल ऑफ द डेटा एनालिस्ट एंड दिस इज द क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द स्टोर प्रोसीजर एज आई डिस्कस स्टोर प्रोसीजर इज प्ले इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल ऑन द इंटरव्यू सो इफ यू हैव द Uh, better understanding on the store procedure so i already uh, provided you the complete uh, store procedure training on my play uh, on my channel so you can find the complete uh, store procedure and user defined function uh, i have 40 video uh, which is related to the uh, user defined function and the store procedure in the both uh, english and the hindi language and if uh, if you have the complete understanding of the store procedure and the user defined function uh, you can uh, crack any type of the interview so this is the very interesting question uh, asked for the uh, data analyst profile in the infosys so one of my student he attend the interview and uh, he face uh, this is the little bit uh, advanced question so if you have uh, some type of the experience in the sql and uh, if you are attending the interview this type of the question uh, definitely you will get so uh, let's discuss about the uh, what the question is there so basically uh, the question is the uh, related to the store procedure and uh, real time also this type of the scenario we using most of the time in the real time while we working so the question is the develop a store procedure to remove the any a special character in a table like uh, i have this table uh, let's see example of the deem customer table and in address line uh, if you select the uh, this address line address 1 uh, you can see uh, under the for the customer key uh, 100 under this uh, address line we have some type of the special character in the uh e or, or also the copyright uh, let me copy paste here so you will better understanding so you can see uh, this is the special character and this is the special character so any this type of the special character available in this column any of the column uh, you need to be removed and uh, also if any other any of the table not the related to any table so basically we have the deem employee like uh, you can see uh, we have the marketing assistant copyright will be there okay so this type of the uh, uh, this type of the any type of this sp uh, special character will be available you need to be removed and the second one is the uh, what is the input parameter the input parameter is the table name and the column name okay so basically you need to be pass the table name and the column name so all the special character will be uh, removed like for example Uh, uh i have this store procedure is working uh, i passing the table name dim customer and address line and if you try to run this procedure uh, so you can see uh, this procedure will be remove any type of the special character available under the address line column 1 if you have any any other column uh, related to something the uh, same table just you need to be keep change the column name and also you can pass the multiple column column name at a time so this this type of the requirement they uh, provided so now you can see this execution is completed and now you can see there is no special character so special character is got uh, removed so i will discuss about the how you can achieve this type of the requirement if you face this type of the question on the uh, real time so hope you understand uh, the question uh what exactly question so uh before starting if you uh, practice this type of the question on the sql uh you can directly enroll on my portal which is the study at education you can click on the view all courses and uh, you can just click on the practice and download sql uh, interview question and uh, if you want to learn the complete sql uh you can enroll this and uh, we running uh, uh the the 50% discount on the 15th august so you will get the 30% discount uh, use independence code okay so code coupon code is the independent 
so you will get 30% additional discount each and every course and I am going to start this one to one training live training uh, from this coming Saturday ok so in this Saturday I am going to start so you can also enroll this complete uh, course and you can crack any type of the interview related to the SQL so I am discussing here how you can uh, create the store procedure so I will discuss how we can let me uh, create the scenario again uh, like uh, I have this uh, uh, again this table if you can see we have some type of the special character so to develop this store procedure uh, first we need to be check that this procedure is uh, already available in the database or not so uh, before creating a uh, view need to be check this procedure is already available then first need to be drop and then create this uh, procedure and the, as per the requirement we need to be create for that input parameter is the table name and the column name so I am passing two input parameter one is the table name uh, where care 1000 and where care uh, 1000 and after that as begin so basically uh, to remove the special character here we need to be use the dynamic SQL because uh, if you use the select star from table name ok so basically uh, where co column what you need to be do so from you need to be uh, concatenate with the table name so dynamically we need to be execute so I declare one uh, variable so if you not have the understanding of the dynamic SQL uh, just you can go with this uh, all the tutorial you can find the related to dynamic SQL video so I declare one variable SQL uh, where care max and I am assigning to the value so basically I am updating the table so update table name so we concatenating with the uh, plus symbol uh, with the table name I am setting the value so if you if you do manually something like that ok like uh, let me show you uh, through some type of the, this uh, special character if you want to remove from this uh, uh, window ok so uh, basically uh, what you can do you can just use the replace function ok so update the table name so in place of the table name you can put the uh, something like a dim customer after that you need to be put the set command ok so set you need to be uh, use the which column you want to update so basically we changing frequently the column name so that is the reason we use here the column name as a concatenation so if you use the column name is equal to replace function from where you want to replace ok so again you need to be pass the column name ok so basically here you need to be use the uh, replace function so replace function is basically what they are doing they basically whatever the value will you have like suppose if you have the uh, this copyright ok so like uh, uh, let me paste this copyright value here ok so basically they will replace with the copyright ok so uh, just you can use the copyright with the some uh, space ok so like some space will be should be there so what will be happen they manually replace all this copyright to the uh, some single space so once you execute manually uh, run this part of the code what will be happen they remove from this any type of the special character which is the uh, copyright will be there so now you can see copyright got removed from here so same thing uh, we can uh, apply it for any type of the special character so I so you can see this type of the special character is there so I taken the couple of the examples so you, you can see copyright will be uh, removing I use the here the copyright here so at the A something special character will be there U will be there uh, something uh, copyright if you want to use the complete copyright uh, um, uh, character will be there R registered uh, trade will be trademark will be there ok so percentage symbol is different so you can just keep adding here if you figured out any new uh, special character so basically after the update statement uh, you need to be execute the SQL statement ok so uh, once you execute the SQL statement this uh, dynamically SQL will be execute so now if you install this store procedure after the installation of the store procedure uh, keep changing the here the table name like let's see example of the different table so I have one table that is the dim employee table so under the dim employee table uh, you can see uh, we have the title column uh, copyright is available marketing assistant 
so now you can just change here the table name okay so in place of the dim customer and the title you need to be changed okay so now if you change the title here and now if you run this procedure so now you can see and this is a very reusable store procedure so just keeping changing the title now you can go back and see the dim employee table so now you can see a marketing assistant will be changed okay so like this uh, uh, like this you need to be just keep something the you need to be handled so now you can see something coming uh, like the marketing uh, ab assistant they change the some type of the uh, structure of the table okay so uh, basically you need to be uh, more focus on this particular what you put it here the something uh, replace statement okay so uh, you just keep in the whatever the special character they provided you the client here so they can just you can put the in under the replace function so if you able to uh, solve this type of the question you have the better understanding of the dynamic sql uh, we have the better understanding of the store procedure and uh, also you have the uh, replace function so how you can use the replace function so this is a very reusable store procedure will be there okay so that is the reason most of the company they can provide the uh, this type of the question like if you have the most of the time we receive this type of the so uh, you can see if you want to execute again dim customer still you have some type of the uh, something the store uh, something the any type of the uh, special character they will remove each and every special character on the particular address line okay so most of the time we'll get this type of the removing from the address line okay so because the in a, any type of the special character will be available might be data exporting into the different application it might be impacting okay so that is the reason uh, this is a very useful requirement okay so now you can see the special character got removed so i uh, hope you understand how you can solve this type of the uh, question okay so if you have any doubt if you have any need clarification if you need any assistant you can directly attach with me uh, the comment box okay so you can also uh, connect on the uh, social media which is provided the link on the video description and uh, keep learning and keep watching uh, uh, and uh, if you have doubt uh, you can uh, directly uh, uh, co directly provide the question on the video link thank you so much for the watching this complete video we'll meet again in next video thank you